prototype vineyard sprayer named Smart Synthesis was developed based on the commercial model Synthesis manufactured by Caffini Company. The prototype was a trailed sprayer equipped with a 1000 liter polyethylene tank and an actual fan 700 millimeters in diameter and consisting of nine blades sucking the air from the front of a tower shaped air conveyor. The air conveyor is equipped with multiple adjustable deflectors placed internally at the edge of the airstream outlet, thus allowing to direct the airflow to precisely match the canopy shape. The most innovative feature of the smart sprayer is the electrically driven actual fan developed by the Keb Italy company that allows to continuously vary the airflow rate along the vineyard rows based on canopy density. The ultrasonic sensors ad hoc designed by Topcon and installed one per spray aside provide in real time an index value for the canopy density based on the detection of multiple edges in a scan. The electric power transmission system is composed of a generator connected to the tractor's mechanical energy source, namely power takeoff. A speed multiplier enables the electric motor speed to reach an adequate back electromotive force at the generator terminals. The generator and electric motor are both connected to the same direct current bus through the Keb T6 double inverter system. The control unit, based on the Raspberry Pi microcontroller, processes through an algorithm the canopy density index values received via the CAN bus at a rate of 35 milliseconds. The control unit then communicates the set electric motor rotational speed in the range of 0 to 2400 rpm to the inverter via the CAN bus every 100 milliseconds. Consequently, the actual fan rotational speed varies to match the required airflow. Ad hoc field trials were conducted during the prototype development to validate under field conditions the sensors by comparing the canopy density index measured by ultrasonic sensors with the real numbers of leaf layers manually measured by operators applying the inclined point quadrat technique. In general, ultrasonic sensors reliably determine the vine canopy density along the whole growing season, showing high levels of correlation with the numbers of leaf layers measured through point quadrat techniques. Concerning the spray unit, the smart sprayer was equipped with a Dynajet Flex 7140 pulse width modulation, namely PWM spray system provided by T-Jet technology company T-Jet. The PWM system is featured by eight solenoid valves per spray aside, each coupled with a single nozzle holder. The PWM valves vary the duty cycle of the pulse signals to change the spray outputs at a frequency of 20 Hz. Furthermore, the PWM system uses a blended pulse in which every other nozzle operates at an alternate frequency. The PWA spray system, commanded by a dedicated Raspberry Pi based controller, allows the variable rate spray application. The PWM spray system enables us to vary continuously the total liquid flow rate to be applied in the range of 30% to 100% according to the selected duty cycle without varying the spray pressure and therefore keeping the droplet size spectra generated the same. Based on field trials carried out during the development of the smart sprayer, the on-off effect of the PWM spray system working at different duty cycles does not affect the uniformity of spray coverage measured within canopies at different depths and heights. Neither do the adopted forward speeds show a significant effect. Mm -hmm. 
Concurrently, 360 litres per hectare was demonstrated to be the optimal spray volume at full growth stage for espalier trellised vineyards, as the spray coverage was maximised avoiding overspray situations. So, 360 litres per hectare was used as a basis for variable rate application, accounting for 100% of the applied volume rate. Thanks to the GPS antenna, the smart sprayer is able to navigate the prescription maps, providing information about the presence and the severity of downy mildew disease obtained through a field scouting, carried out before the treatment using an early detection system. The nozzle's flow rate, therefore the pesticide dose applied, is automatically tuned along the rows according to the disease prescription maps using the PWM spray system. Concurrently, the airflow rate generated by the electrically driven fan is continuously adapted to the canopy presence and density, which are detected by ultrasonic sensors. The prototype smart synthesis sprayer was compared to the commercial synthesis in vineyard field trials to assess its spray application efficiency. Briefly, the two sprayers were tested in the same trellised vineyard plot following ISO 22522 and ISO 22866 standardised methodologies to evaluate spray canopy distribution and spray drift. The results underline a 22% reduction of total air volume applied using the smart sprayer compared to the commercial sprayer features by mechanically driven axial fan working at a fixed rotational speed. The overall reduction of total air volume combined with the punctual variation along the rows of airflow rate to precisely match the canopy density led to a 38% increment of canopy deposition, as well as an overall reduction of spray drift, sediments next to the sprayed area comprised between 22 and 74% were measured according to the increasing distance from the applied area were obtained. Furthermore, the possible energy saving of the smart sprayer compared to a conventional sprayer was evaluated. Preliminary results indicated that the smart sprayer with variable fan airflow rate consumed on average 30% less energy, which is promising in terms of fuel consumption reduction. Recently, the smart synthesis sprayer has won awards at international exhibitions. At the EIMA International Exhibition held in Italy, it received the Technical Innovation Prize and Blue Award for its recognised capability to reduce environmental contamination risks. Meanwhile, at the SIT EVI exhibition held in France, it was nominated as one of the most innovative machinery for pesticide spray application. Mm -hmm.